Hey, here's another reaction video. Welcome back to my channel, DJ Nichols Comedy. I'm DJ Nichols. You can call me DJ for short. Yes, you can call me DJ for short. And I'm back with another ultra horror short film reaction video. Genius. This one is called Piggy. Let me read the description for this. As you might have seen this before. Okay, it says. Sarah is an overweight teen that lives in the shadow of a clique of schoolgirls holidaying in her village, not even her childhood friend. Claudia defends her when she's bullied at the local pool in front of an unknown man. Her clothes are stolen and Sarah must get home wearing nothing but her bikini. The long walk home will mark the rest of her life. Yo, that sounds messed up. Not even her friends helping her out. It's messed up. But uh, let's see. Um, Cass Laura Galen, uh, the lead uh, character. She she does a good job on this. She does a really good job. I think uh, she's actually really funny in this. Just kidding. Uh, she uh, was very, you know, good. She had me, she had me shook, uh, to be honest. Uh, seeing this, the director, uh, Carlotta Pereira must have, she must have done. I don't know what else uh, Carlotta Pereira has done, but this, I think has put her on the map for sure. This uh, short is really popular. I got some Craven plain regular chips. I don't know why I got these. I just, I just like the plain chips. So I got these and I got some corn chips. Some really good corn chips. Uh, honey barbecue. No artificial flavors right here. Yeah. Let's, let's crack these bitches open. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, see, this dude's cleaning the pool. He's looking at her. He must be the dude that uh, the bullies bullied her in front of. Usually don't show what I'm drinking in my glass. It's usually Coca-Cola. Check this out right here. Listen to that. Yeah, that don't sound very fresh. Coca-Cola was going on. No, usually that motherfucker is louder than that. <laughs> They didn't, they didn't want to work for me, did they? Like the thing about it right here is I'm thinking, come on now, Sarah. Come on now, baby girl. You know, unless unless she has some kind of job where she's like, you know, like scrap hunting. So she's going in the water like this creepy ass water scrap hunting. She doesn't have no reason to swim in that water. It's just, it looks so contaminated. Dirty. Uh, 
huge kid. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even think they're necessarily kids though. They could be a girl. <laughs> There's some parents out there right around the corner like, yes, yes, you're very naughty girls. <laughs> Let them hang on everybody. <laughs> like, Come on, take your money. <laughs> Summer is over. It's back to bully season again, you know. It's back to people being an asshole again. Instead of, you know, learning a trade. Seriously. People do try to get away with some bullshit. All over. It's spooky. Now look at that. See, that's embarrassing. She like running down the street, no clothes, just butt naked. I took all her clothes, I took her backpack. It's a jukebox for me. That dirty ass one. Who do these fucking dipshits? <laughs> Dude, this is exactly what I'm saying. This is exactly why people get fucked up in movies. But then, how is it the whole damn town is just corrupt like that? Like, everybody just a, a, a fuckhead. <laughs> the only thing about that situation is like if this was like a Columbine situation the bullies are the ones that shot up the school the kids that were bullies they were being bullies they were being bullies and then that's when the trench coat mafia started kids started wearing trench coats to stay away from the bullies and shit. That everybody started wearing the same thing. Then the bullies wanted to be a part of the trench coat mafia. And they the bullies, the kids that were getting bullied, they were like, no, you ain't you ain't in this group. No. And so they felt some type of way. They dressed up as the trench coat mafia and went and shot the whole school up. Now you can't even be trench coat mafia anymore. <laughs> that fucked up. Whoa. They said everybody should get in, even the bullies. <laughs> That's why. Like, That's why like being a crackhead and your drug dealer is in your meeting with you and shit. <laughs> I mean, that drug dealer needs to take his ass to an NA meeting and shit. But that really rare.
Man. How far away is this pool from where you live, Sarah? Oh. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. Dude, I was at the pool. You were in trouble for like a second. Look, look what I got, sir. Look at this. Look in the back seat. Oh! Do you help them? I feel like you do. I mean, even though they stole your fucking clothes and your money. It was like, that shit, like, instant karma. <laughs> like, what do you do? You call 911? Uh, this kid, I see this kid getting murdered in her backseat. The license plate. Oh, this dude got your bag. They were like, look, this dude's trying to take your bag. Oh, that's what happened. <laughs> he like, oh, see you later. <laughs> back to my back to my murdering spree. <laughs> That's what I think about that. Oh shit. She's like, Sarah! Sarah, help me! They ain't even Sarah's friends and shit. Does she don't know you? Should've been trying to steal my shit. Oh. Oh my god. Well, that's it for me, guys. <coughs> Share, like, comment, subscribe, and kick on that bell icon so you can get notified when I upload new content. If so facto, I'm was another Alter War short film reaction. Hit me. Click on the next video right now.